Hey, what's good, y'all? It's your boy Don from the Don Show of Friends, and we are back for another K-pop reaction. And I got the bro back in the building. What's good, y'all? Yeah. I mm -hmm. do not have a catchphrase, but it is all good. I'm excited to be here. It's been a while. See, there you go. I've been living life, mm -hmm. trying to get it, man. Taking mm -hmm. care of my mental health. Fun fact: been losing weight. 430 last year. I'm down to 384. I know it don't look like it, you know, sexual chocolate in the building. Anyways, though, I'm really excited to be here with my homeboy, <laughs> my homie Ice Man. What we watching today? So today, this is what we got. So what we're gonna do is uh, BTS Mic Drops, hey. Steve Aoki's remix of official music video. He is the GOAT. Yeah, he is one of the yeah, yeah. Yes. He got a nice place in Vegas too. Oh wow. Mm -hmm. okay. okay. So listen, check this out. So we're gonna knock this out for y'all. Let me know if y'all enjoy this. We're trying to get y'all more uh, music videos, plain and simple. So. We're just gonna go from there and get started and leave your comments and let me know why did you like this video. Alright, so let's get started in three, two, one. Let's see what they're here for. Mm -hmm. What you know what's funny? What's up? <laughs> I'm about to change my topic now. Everybody uses that sh that video uh, area. Yeah. Like that they, they did Batman in that. I like that. I like that. And I'm really about that DC life. Mm. Yeah. Now y'all know I know y'all know I know this choreography, so I'm really gonna see what they do with the shots. Mm. Push in. Yeah. Mm. Push in. Ah! Ah! Yeah. Okay, 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 okay. So one, I love, I like, yeah, so I don't I don't do music videos, but mm -hmm. they use this type of setup more a lot. Mm -hmm. um, it's it's really a good way to minimize your space. Mm -hmm. Like it's 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 and, and it's beautiful. You have all of that light just shining down on your subject. But I just love like how they started off. And you know it's 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 Steve, man. It's Aoki. Yeah. So you know you know what it is. But I love the close up here. I just I love all of that, man. I swear him and his sister look just. Oh like. yeah, they definitely do. But I love. Shout out to the fog machine that they used here. You can see the two lights right in the corner right there. And, mm -hmm. and then I was wondering what they were going to do with this. Now, it's called Mic Drop, so I'm sure it's about to, it's, it's going to be some cold stuff. Yeah. Um. There was some symbolism of like, they was in a room, like they was being questioned. Yeah. And then it was mics, and then it was a whole bunch of people in there just bobbing their head. Yeah, 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 yeah. So they on, you think they on trial or something? But I like... Like you know, the, the 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 transition though mm -hmm. that seamless transition. Well, you use the keyboard. All right. Hold on. Push in. Then wow. Oh yeah. Okay. I like that. And they disappeared and they gone. All right. Oh yeah. Okay. They protested. But it looked like they had add more in in, in the edits of fall. Yeah. You can tell yeah, it looks like it. Do it. They probably do it. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> oh, okay, yep. okay. So check this. This transition is dope right there. Look, it goes up, uh, and then the you know the color, the color mm -hmm. balance on there is mm -hmm. uh, a little bit more warm on this one. Mm -hmm. Looks like they are in. Uh, what is this a? A prison? A jail? I don't know. To me, it's like a prison. Prison? Mm hmm Hold on. Ah, ah, yeah, that's what I just wanted to see yeah. that. I love that pop in. Yeah. Mm. Yo, so you know why I always tell y'all all the time, like, why it's so important to have your choreography together? Because when you have the camera crew recording, that also plays an effect on the edits of the like, in my opinion, not speaking no facts of the transitions. Yeah. I'm, and, Cause I'm a dancer and I really love that dance life that I do. So when I, since I know the choreography already, so when they doing the transitions, what I'm paying attention to now is that the camera get it. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I have seen a lot of film work where the camera crew was not connected to the choreography. You gotta be connected, and it's important for dancers for the choreography to be down pat. Yeah, which is why y'all practice so much because just like y'all are blocking. Yeah, as camera crews, we have our own choreography as far as like how we're moving mm -hmm. the camera. So 
there's a certain way that you have to move to make the elements really right. pop or to make to really emphasize some of the movements that y'all are doing. Mm -hmm. So we're blocking our movements. A lot of times we might have a steady cam, but we're blocking how we're moving. If we're going to be tilting down, yep. if we're going to be panning, if we're going to be pushing in, or if we're going to be on a dolly, everything has to be very in sync. Um, it has to, well, on our end, we have to, we make sure we hire the best of the best mm -hmm. of the camera operators. But for the editor, mm -hmm. right? Because every everything is like on a schedule, or yep. everything is like organized down to the T. What's the color gonna look like? What's the shot gonna Seriously. look like? You know, okay, what movement are they doing here? Okay, so when they do this, mm -hmm. we gonna be doing this. And a lot of times we storyboarding too. Mm -hmm. So we're getting with the creative director. Yep. Of the music video. Yeah. And they're like, okay, so when he does that, yep. I need you to. Cause you notice yeah. I muted it for y'all. Cause what he's breaking down. He's talking about these parts. Yeah. So what he's saying is like how this is so important. Y'all know we do that mute part where we just now we just watching it, but just pay attention to like Ooh, I the love choreography that. I love that. and don't worry y'all we gonna go back with the music. But just notice how clean the choreography is and the camera knowing wow. when to zoom in. Wow, hold on. Yeah. So you see, boom, right? Yeah. Okay. And then he's about to. Yep. Now look at that. But you notice. You see, hold on, you see that like, and uh, and it has to be so on point when we do the takes that you, so when he did it on that take, when he did his hand like yeah. that, on the next take, he basically did the same exact movement, so there you that go. cut there you go. could be very seamless, that transition could be very seamless. Mm -hmm. I love it. Yeah. I love it. Let's run it, let's run it back. Yeah, so let's go back, y'all, now let's just watch it with sound. Just so y'all can understand how it makes sense, because this is, y'all love this band, and it's like, for us coming in, we're we're telling y'all from our perspective like what we are, what we know, and what we work hard to do. So let's get it. So now watch it. Check it out. Notice the choreography. Notice the transitions. And that's choreography. I'm counting. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. With him moving and everyone else moving yeah. in slow motion behind him. Y'all see it? This is what I mean. Everything gotta be on. We know this choreography, y'all, so we know what to expect. Oh, you see, you see you him see, in the background. You see, you see Steve he, in the back. Yeah, he's like, he's, I, I like that. It's like, uh, it's like the lack. What, what's, what's that guy? Uh, Galactus and Marvel's Capcom. Oh yeah, kind of like uh, looming up behind him. I look. Yeah, Galactus. Yeah, look at that. Hey, the camera crew really getting the choreography. Seriously. Yeah. Mmm. <laughs> that transition is still tight. It's still tight. So here's one thing I really like. I really like. So one thing that I've been noticing, or at least, and this and this is from other people that I've looked at. Um, I'm still a growing videographer, mm -hmm. but one of the things I've noticed with dance is that there are certain levels that you want to have the camera um, in order to emphasize certain things. So a lot of times in group mm -hmm. shots, you either want to have it up. But if we're trying to emphasize and show that the that whoever we're showing has power, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying, you want to do more of a lower angle. So so you see it's see how it started off high, but right. now it's low. So you really you're really emphasizing the power in their moves. Yeah. And then I'm a mm. that might that is more than likely a cut that they did in the post. Yeah. Where it just jumps in. But it's all it's all synchronized. From the choreography, mm -hmm. from the way it's shot, mm -hmm. and from the way that it's edited, the different cuts, a lot of times they're cut on different parts of the beat. Mm -hmm. There is a there is a pacing that goes with it. So I'm sure in dancing there's certain pace oh, that you yeah. have. So if you if it's a if you're trying to really emphasize movements, you might slow it mm -hmm. down a little bit. But if you're trying to go fast, you might I don't know. You still gotta be controlled. Yeah, yeah, I follow, I follow. Same thing when it comes to putting together a music video, at least from my experience, yeah. the pacing, all of that plays together. So just making a cut slightly off beat will throw it all off. You may not be able to understand why it is. So shout out to the, the production crew on this because Noted. me, someone who's not a dancer, mm -hmm. this looks freaking amazing 
and it's all because they're on point with their moves. Mm -hmm. I'm sure that they had to be in, in shape to be able to do multiple takes in these different locations. Oh yeah. And the camera people, and, and the camera department, the, the, the director, all mm -hmm. that, the DP, had to also be on point. So I just wanted to take some time to yeah. say shout out to that. And you gotta stay looking cute as you did. Yeah. <laughs> Unless it's that sweaty. Oh yeah, you press play, yeah. bro. Yeah. They so used to me talking while the video going. See, I was a yeah. little bit high up, but now it's level. Now it's low. Yeah. Remember when we watched the dance practice and we was talking about how the artist is starting to like, when the artists get the rapping or get the singing, it's like you understand like where the focal point at. I like that. So that, that looks like there. That looks like, uh, <laughs> the equipment room of a lot of camera departments. Facts. I won't be surprised if it really is. So I'm interested in the scene. But you, uh, hey, but let me tell y'all this. This is not an easy shot. They now, have, they have, yeah. Now go ahead, go ahead. watch this. So let's meet this real quick. Watch this part when he goes into that room when he's being questioned. Notice the back. Notice the back, right? Look at his reflection. I did some research about how to actually do this shot. Yeah. Notice how he came in. That's that's not an easy shot to do and edit. That's that's not easy. That's that's. So I'm assuming they probably masked it, right? Yep. Yeah, they had to. Not 100 percent sure, but if they didn't mask it or put some type of effect on it, mm -hmm. you would see mm -hmm. the camera person. You would see. You'd oh, see you the would... cameraman. Yeah, because it looks so simple, y'all. Look how simple it looks. It's like, oh, he's just right there. But look again. Like, yeah. look at that. Oh, you saw that? Hold on, yeah. my bad. You no, no, you the, good? The, the gun. The... Hold on. Where is it? I'm waiting on it. I'm waiting on it. Uh -huh. Bow! Back in there. Yep. He jumps in the frame. Yep. Blocking. Now Didn't he's it. coming in the frame. Yep. Same move. I love how they shooting this. Now he's in the frame. Yeah. There's the That's frame. A cra this is a crazy crazy video if you really appreciate them pay attention to how the cameraman and the crew is all together with the whole song oh yeah. you like that you like that and you have a video he likes right it here. too you, yeah yeah you like it i like it yep yeah steve but look turn up boom I'm, yep. i just like the transition yeah. there the flicker yeah to that yeah and check the back look at look up there in the back shots like that's set, cold. set design is probably one of the most number one things that's why i'm still learning set design you you get you a cold person who who a creative director who really knows their stuff with the set design the background of your videos mm -hmm. play equally if not more important uh part, a, a big component a big piece mm -hmm. of a very dope looking video there, there are people who, I mean, that's a big part of the budget too. Mm -hmm. But if you have a very boring background, yeah, they could. I mean, the dancing speaks for itself. Yeah. But if you have a very boring background, or if the background doesn't really lend itself to the theme of the music video, you know, it, it's just discombobulated. So shout out, and and so uh, I'm I'm curious to know how much is practical effects and how much is you know digital. Because uh, that's a big that's a big piece too, so. But yeah, but you see, you notice though, it's more, it's far apart, but it's a little bit lower. So yes. it's not. Yeah, it's a little bit lower. So it's so you're really so you can really see. Most dance videos are kind of shot at a lower angle. Like it if it is because because of the fact, even though regardless of the height of the artists, even the choreographers, like it's still it's something about that shot that works because if you go back to usher let it burn when he was in when he was at the end and he started dancing the camera was like like it was down and you see all the flames like let it burn and actually to be honest with y'all what i know about this video that i noticed that where a lot of inspiration is coming from is you showed there's kendra lamar uh, inspiration of um not dna humble humble the way this the, is some inspirations of these shots you know what I'm saying? Like the shots are similar, not inspiration, but more similarities of these shots. Mm -hmm. Because you won't be surprised. The prior to the directors and the team of this, I won't be surprised if they had played a part in the Kendra Lamar. You don't know. Yeah. That's the beauty of this art form when it comes to filming, because you can see inspiration through all music and all sound of yeah. how people are filming stuff. Because look at that shot. When I was watching this, I'm like, Dark Knight, Mommy and Batman, easily. 
boom. Now it reminds me of Kendrick Lamar's videos and, and, and that whole capture. And then I think BTS did something like this outside in a park when he was on a bridge. You can just notice all those shots. So when they, and you know BTS can dance their ass off. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And look how they got them shot perfectly. Like the, the cars. And so yeah, there's, that's what I'm saying. there yeah. is another thing. I don't, don't want to take too much of y'all time. <laughs> but when it comes to the set design and the way things are displayed on the screen, there is symmetry. Mm -hmm. So you got a video they call leading lines. So you, oh, you, you kind of want to have. So if you, I wish we could do a graphic like we on Madden or something. I wish, hey, that'd be so. Tight. But you see, so we got a car, these cars in the foreground that's blurry. You got this car here that's also in the foreground, mm. and then you got so it's one, two, three, one, two, that. and then you got two there. So it's it's, and then you got a light pole and a light pole. So it's, oh, so like I said, it's all part of the set design. I didn't, it, it may, I'm just, I'm not just talking here. It like I said that. That was a conscious decision, yeah. but when I'm talking about leading lines, or you're, you, I how I interpret it as you're leading the viewer mm -hmm. to to focus on what's in the middle mm -hmm. of the screen, but you oh. still want to have the video. You still want to have the set design or the background of the video lend itself so, oh. to it. So I don't know. That's just something that I noticed. And of course, you know, you got the fire. So it's just it's just a, a blazing visual, pun intended huh. for sure. But yeah, and, and and actually every shot in this video has some symmetry to it. Like I said, the background, the set design of every shot has to, it plays a part. Mm -hmm. It's not just random. It is all meant to lend itself to the video. Mm -hmm. And so, it, yeah, that's, it. we all go back and watch it. Every shot has that. So that's just something that I, that I kind of picked up on. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Noted. Mm. That's my part. Even in the dance practice, that was my part. That was the only part that wasn't a fan up in the choreography. Not even gonna lie to y'all. Not by the cat. Okay, that's. Yeah, I think that's probably. This digital. shot that's tight. But yeah, so you can one, two, three. And a lot of music videos use this concept with this type of shot. I can't remember who last person that used this. Yeah. So you coming in? So like I said, you got it's something going. It's it's not just a boring background. It's not. You know what I'm saying? So you got bus back there. Yeah. You got. I see what you mean though. The balance. Yeah. And now you know how to get to the climax. Just how they do their choreography. There it is. It's, it's the pace is speeding yeah. up. It's going a lot faster. Get that heart rate up. Mike, Mike drop. drop. Yep. That's all you need. Even then, leading lines, right? Yeah. You got. Damn, I can see it. Mike's here. Mike's there. You got the thing on the on the wall there. You got yeah. the two. It's symmetry. You got two light, two LED lights on that left side, on the right side. Yeah. You got. That thing coming, I, I can't describe it. But you know, we had to create storyboards like when we was in high school. I remember, do you remember drawing when we had yeah. to make the box and take the lines and create that balance? Yeah. That's why storyboards are so important. Even him, look. Look, look. look at, yeah, you look right. Look at that. Look Damn. at the pillars right behind him. So you look at. Yeah. So look, the way that they shot that. Oh my God. Him being, this is this this is this is a, a beautiful shot to end it on. Um, and, I, and I think, like I say, it, it is. A, a beautiful shot because I mean Steve Aoki he's a DJ right yeah, yeah. producer producer DJ yeah DJ okay throw a cake in your face mm -hmm. this is a good way I feel to still show him love uh huh because you know he DJing I think you know I, I think how a lot of times this work if it's his remix that means he he put his little spin on it mm -hmm. put some flair on it but yeah you got the uh, the panel lights above him mm -hmm. you got him right in the middle. So he's the focus, but like I said, leading lines. Each of these panels got leading lines. It's symmetrical. You got one, two, three, four, five, six, six seven, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve. So it's yeah. six, and then you got the two pillars right there. Boom! Wow. All it's all that's that's not a that's none of none of these things that are in music videos are ever coincidence. I'm sure that's a given. <sighs> But there's a like shout out to the the teams behind these music videos because there's a lot of and that's why they get paid the big bucks 
there's a lot of thought. There's a lot of there's a lot of thought that goes into what these videos are going to be, even if it's just a, a video of people dancing. Yeah. All that adds to the visuals, y'all. Damn. I'm over here sweating. This is a no, damn you, good video. No, you use a, a damn you, good use a cinematographer, bro. You talking your you, you talking your shit. It's a damn good video. I love it, man. Hey. I, I appreciate y'all um having me in today. I, I'm not on a lot of yeah. videos, but um Yeah, y'all, I'm I'm make y'all do this because we freestyle these videos. We never like try to affect the funk. Like we want to do real review and reaction. So I didn't I didn't get him ready for this. I yeah. honestly didn't. Like I wasn't ready either. I just we just turned it on. We like, yo, mic drop and it's Steve. Yeah. So, so I'm I'm a person who loves feedback. So mm -hmm. any feedback that you have for me, um, any feedback that you have for what I was talking about or what I shared on this reaction video, please put that in the comments. And um, if you'd love for him to react to more music videos that y'all think was great of the information because I learned something and we work together. So I just learned something that I have to pay attention to for our projects that I was like, oh my God, I didn't even think about that. Yeah, so. this is this is where I'm at in my personal journey. Mm -hmm. I am learning more. I'm taking more time to learn about these elements. Mm -hmm. So I've been taking a lot of time just to research this because I've been overlooking it. And now I, I see, mm -hmm. I realize what one thing I really love about this video is just everything that came into it. It had different locations. Um, but the choreography was tight so that way when they was able to make them edits it was all seamless mm -hmm. and from the from the color scheme from the background from the effects mm -hmm. whether it was practical or digital it was it was solid man um yes. bts always has some damn they always have good videos though i mean like, they yeah. always have great videos yeah. actually so yeah thank y'all you know what i'm saying it. and listen uh other than that y'all uh announcements that are coming soon but right now we just want to keep dropping these videos like right now honestly we just want to keep dropping these videos for y'all summer coming out and i want y'all to have good contact in the summer so we just gonna keep it pumping but other than that y'all we'll see y'all again soon take care peace, peace. and we get y'all a long video better like y'all like y'all <laughs>